My name is John Zimmer. I'm the owner of Sound Representation, which specializes in the sales of high-end audio equipment. I really learned everything that I know about high-end audio from working at this store that we're sitting in right now, Stereo Exchange. I'm gonna teach you what to look for when you wanna shop for a stereo. When talking about a home theater, it's important to understand the source material it's designed around. A home theater was meant to play back the information on a DVD. A stereo was meant to play back the information found on a CD. So on a CD, you have information for two speakers, hence a stereo system. On a DVD, you actually have information for five separate speakers. So the point one that you always hear, like 5.1 or 7.1, that point one stands for a subwoofer. Usually bigger is better when it comes to a home theater system, so you can really position speakers kind of all around you and kind of be right in the mix of the whole thing. In smaller rooms, I would just suggest getting smaller speakers. In order to hear a DVD the way that it was meant to be heard, you need five speakers in a subwoofer or seven speakers in a subwoofer set up in your listening room. 